Hello Excel, this is Lit here. Today I want to talk about Prisoner's Gate. This is the map you will arrive after you kill Brutus. And in this map, there will be a three, three different um, entrance. So how you navigate this map is based on the entrance. So if your entrance is facing bottom right, you always take the upper wall and you hug it until you find an alley, uh, a tunnel. So you remember the first point of the tunnel, you follow the tunnel, and you arrive at the end of the tunnel, and what you need to do is put a line from this tunnel to that tunnel. This is somewhat a diagonal line, if this makes sense. This one is not in line with this one. So if this is pointing this way, we will take the opposite learn. So basically, if the point of the of the on the beginning of the tunnel and the other tunnel is forming diagonal line, you will always take the opposite uh, direction. So in this case, we will turn right and we will find the second alley and we just follow the alley until we find this ledge. You jump down and you basically just follow the road until you find the exit. So in this one, the entrance is facing bottom right. In this one, we always hug the top wall until we see the tunnel and after the tunnel this tunnel is facing diagonal on the right the entrance and the exit so in this one we will turn in the opposite direction this will be on the left and we will find our tunnel here and we keep following the tunnel until we find this ledge again and we jump down and we keep moving to the exit it's not far now we on the entrance that facing um, bottom right in this entrance, you always take the upper wall and you're going to hug it. The ledge is always on the top. So you just follow it until you see this tunnel. And after you see this tunnel, you see the tunnel, uh, the end of the tunnel and the start of the tunnel. This one is forming a straight line. So if this is a straight line, uh, the exit will be on the front, somewhat on the front. So you just keep following this second tunnel until you find this ledge and you go down Wisdom. and the exit is pretty close and this time the entrance is facing top left in this entrance we always going to have this uh, wall until we find the ledge here we find the ledge and we keep following this until we find the tunnel and after we find the tunnel in this second room there's a two possible exit the first one is over here the second one is over here so i'm suggesting just turn left and walking toward this, if you do not find anything on here, you will walk toward this direction and you will find the tunnel exit. So this, this is tunnel, we just follow the tunnel and until you see this ledge, you go down, you walking toward the exit. So we are on the top left entrance again and this one we always take the north, this wall and we will find this ledge, so we will follow the ledge until we find the tunnel and after the tunnel and this one we will keep moving forward and we will find the tunnel is over here so in another version it will be on here and this one is will be on here so we're just following the tunnel and you will find the same ledge the same ledge here you jump down Alteration. and you go toward the exit here so this time the entrance is facing top right so we will check on the bottom do we find the ledge we do not find the ledge and this means uh, the ledge will be on the top. We will follow the ledge until we find the tunnel. And in this tunnel, uh, the exit always on the right, so we will go to the right. And this will be a second tunnel. And after this, we just need to follow the tunnel until we find this ledge. And we jump down the ledge and we just follow in the wall and we will see the entrance. So we are on the entrance that facing uh, top right again. In this case, we have this wall. When you see this wall, you always go to the top, um, top left. And when you see this wall, just hug this wall until you meet the tunnel. And this is the tunnel. And you go inside the tunnel until you go into this room. And this room, uh, there's only two exit, which is the one is number here. The second one is number here. And if you find this wall. You know that the entrance, uh, the exit is on this way. So you just keep following until you find this ledge and you jump down and you keep following uh, the wall and you will find the exit. The exit is not that far. And one caveat about this uh, layout 
if you go into the rooms to uh, this second room and there is no this wall you will have to check this side and then check this side so basically there's two possibilities just take check two of them so this time the entrance is facing top right so in this case we will go down uh, we were looking for the ledge we find the ledge so we will keep moving down and if we find the tunnel that facing down like this we will hug this wall until we find the second tunnel so you just hug this wall until you find the second tunnel which will be here this is the second tunnel and we just follow the tunnel until we find this ledge and we jump down from this ledge and we just follow this wall until we find the exit so this time the entrance is facing top right so we're going to check on the bottom do we see the ledge we do see the ledge so we will follow the ledge until we see the tunnel and this time the tunnel is facing up so we go into the left and we should see the tunnel on the left here is the second tunnel so we're just following up until we find this ledge again and we jump down and we follow this wall on the right wall until we see the entrance this one is a little bit far but you will see the entrance at the end so this is all i know about prisoner's gate my suggestion is if you find the entrance that facing top right i suggest just relock uh relock the area and how you do that is you go to the waypoint and you control click the prisoner gate this will allow you to make a new zone um simply because the other two entrance the entrance that um the one that are facing bottom right and top left is a lot easier to manage and it's a lot more simple to do um, so this will be my suggestions so you don't have to remember um, one entrance that facing top right this one because this is this one is the most complicated one uh, among that three entrance so you can just keep reload reload the area until I don't know why I keep that getting this usually it's not happen this often oh my god this gives me a really bad examples but you get the idea if you find this one this is the most complicated one if you want to remember all of that uh, please do so uh, but my suggestion is just try to relog to get the other like this is the top left this is very easy and the bottom right is also very easy to manage so this is all I have for you today thank you everyone for watching I see you in the next one